Well, flu season isn't just for humans. In fact, canine influenza has been really high this year. Yes, your pets can get the flu. I didn't know that. I know. Our why guy explains why there have been so many cases in 2021. If you're feeling sick, there's nothing like an afternoon on the couch curled up next to your pet. Don't forget to comfort your pup if he gets sick. Dogs don't behave the same way as humans when they're sick, but we do share some of the same illnesses, like the flu. In fact, cases of canine influenza are on the rise in 2021, so let's explore why. First of all, it's a relatively new illness. The first cases of the dog flu were reported in 2007, and they were only in a handful of states. Now there are two strains of canine influenza, and all but two states have reported cases this year with outbreaks in eight different states. Dr. Jerry Klein of the American Kennel Club tells us it's such a new illness, dogs have little to no natural immunities. During the pandemic, pet owners have been less likely to take their pups to the vet for regular wellness checks and shots. There are flu vaccines for dogs that require yearly boosters. Dr. Klein says when a pet owner neglects to take their dog in for a booster, the animal is more vulnerable to canine flu. Pet owners are getting out more than they were early in the pandemic, taking their dogs to the park or boarding them with other animals so they can travel. Those are situations where canine influenza can spread. Dr. Klein says pet owners need to talk to their vet about vaccinations. They're not required and they're not for every dog. If your pet isn't around other dogs much, they may not need to be vaccinated. It might be a good idea if your pet is a social animal. 